Good evening, I'm Mike Brooks with some of the latest news from Two Works for You. We're going to start off with a quick look at the numbers right now. Coronavirus cases in Oklahoma hit more than 3,000 today with 179 deaths in the state. Now we can tell you that 1,800 people have recovered. The Tulsa Health Department is giving us a look at what happens during drive through testing. Today they held a media day with a mock drive up test, a look at testing kits and at the National Guard picking up specimens collected. If you need to be tested, you can call the Tulsa Health Department to set up an appointment. And take a look at this uh, backup. It's not from construction. It's actually dozens of people in line to pick up groceries from a local church. Viewer Jared Horton tells us this was a line from 31st to 41st on Garnett. As people lined up to pick up groceries from a local church, that church has been offering weekly grocery pickups each Thursday. Construction is underway to bring more affordable housing to Tulsa. The Choice Neighborhoods Tulsa site in West Tulsa is where the Riverview Park apartments are being built. Phase one includes 74 housing units made up of townhomes and garden style walk up units. The $18 million phase one plan will take about 18 months to finish. We're tracking the chance for showers and storms on our Friday. A few could be severe. They will be isolated in nature, but large hail would be the primary threat. Can't roll out an isolated tornado, but that's something to watch very closely. The weekend looks great with temperatures soaring back into the 70s across the area. The next week looks warm as well. Another chance for storms coming in Tuesday. Some showers will be possible Monday. All right, Mike, thank you. For more news, just go to our website or our mobile app. Our Two Works Feed morning team will help you start your day bright and early at 4.30 a.m.